Me and Sipper TV, tap in with that boy. Best thing ain't smoking on YouTube, shout out, I ain't lying. Like, comment, subscribe, tell somebody so they can tell somebody. Man, y'all know what time it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm back like I never left. Picked up where I left off with. You know, the last time I had holla y'all, uh, I had busted the radiator. So, the new one in, the new one in, I could have been open it. I was like, nah, I can't do it like that. I gotta let my folks open this jump with me. See me pull the scratch out of the box. But at the same time, I like to correct myself when I'm wrong because sometimes I be so caught up in the moment, I be talking fast. So hold on for a minute. We still got the broke when I'm dead now. So with the last time when I was telling y'all, um, I was like antifreeze, I was like antifreeze run through the fins. I ain't meant to say fins, I meant to say antifreeze run through the tube. The air go through the fan and dissipate the heat and take it away. So I got to start off by saying that, correcting myself. I, I like to put the right information out there. So antifreeze run through these little tubes right here. And then, of course, that's when I bust a hole in it. But anyway, that's out of the way. Let's get to the good stuff. You feel me? Let's get to the good stuff. But yeah, the new John in. And I'm telling you, dog, you know, I'm kind of throw it off a little bit. So man, y'all got to keep me in line. Make sure I don't bust the new one. But I ain't though, I ain't tripping. Y'all hold on for a minute. Like I said, I could have been, um, I could have been, I could have been busted John open and went on here and did that there. But that ain't cool. I rather let my foes tap in with me. And y'all can got down see me busted John open at the same time. Y'all see the new radiator, y'all see the new radiator at the same time. I, I don't see it. Hold on for a minute, let me bust this thing open. We fresh out the box with it too, boy. For real. Exclusive. Tap in with that boy. And I ain't gonna lie, I could have been busted John open. And went on here to um went on here and went on here to um put it in the car. But man, like I said, I ain't for do it without y'all being in the joint with me. Then it been hot as hell like right her too. It been hot as hell like her boy. Shit. I don't got time for it. My barber, he booked up. So I'm rough for running today. It's all good though. Got that pump for next week. Shit. I should've went on here. Got my, I should've went by that journey. Stop by, got my diet. Y'all hold on. Let me get down, get you all this good tape that got on this joint. But yeah, we fresh out the box with this joint now. Fresh out the prayer, brand new right there. And like I said, man, y'all don't let me mess this one up. I don't got time to be spending no money no twice. I'm gonna tell you that now. I don't got time for it. And that's another thing. When you're doing this stuff, take your time and try to do it right the first time for you want how to make a repeat, out For real. That stuff annoying. And just to let you know what's going on, um, I don't know what I tell y'all, but the driver side held up. I got that up though. But the capsule is side held up, I don't. I haven't got that one up there yet, because they have to jump right up and find me. So what I did, because I got some three ton, I got some three ton, um, I got some three ton jack stand. And my big dog, he got the six ton, which is bigger. So I had to go get them, so I can lift that car up a little higher, and I'm going to lift it up by the balancer. Put me a two by four under that balancer, so I can lift it up a little higher. Hell, it catching the edge of my transmission. That's the only thing that's stopping me from um, putting it up there. So what I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, bust it, try to get the radiator put in real quick. So I can, um, at least get that out of the way. And then weekend I'll be battling with the, um, I'll be battling with, um, I'll be battling trying to get the hell on, get that on out of the way. So, then what we got going on, same radiator. We just fresh out the box, you feel me? John looking good too. They got it packaged, packaged up real nice. I don't know what I'm talking about. You know, we went over about the, um, the scribe the last time. I don't know that I showed you, but um, this is my wine kit right here. They got a direction into it, but um, I'm gonna have to wire it another day, cause there gonna be a lot going on trying to put it in and wire right now, and I gotta go to work. But that probably definitely gonna be the weekend type thing right there. So, uh, 
We we um uh, let me goddamn get y'all right for y'all get that verse. We on rapping it right now. I want to get that verse right for y'all to see what's going on. But yeah, this a new jump right here. This a new jump. And as you can see, we don't got no bust a hole right there. Ain't gonna have one this time. And the thing about it, man, you gotta learn from your mistake, boy. Really. Learn from your mistake. Do what I'm talking about. And as you can see, as you can see, everything looking pretty damn good, you have me? We don't got no ripples. We don't got no ripples in the fins. Everything good. So y'all hold on. Y'all stay right up. Just look the joint over. Make sure everything meet my standards. Yeah, we looking damn good now. Looking damn good. Aluminum. It's a um it's aluminum performance right there, a three row. So we're gonna got some nice cool capacity on this jump. You feel me? And another thing I ain't like with my old one, which I am glad I did order a new one. When I got it, this one right here was kind of twisted a little bit like it been bent, so that right there looking good. Alright. And another thing I wanna let y'all know what's going on too is um for my square. So, I've got homeboy now him on Instagram. I shout out to him though. He got the same setup kind of. So, with this squire, he said he, he had a problem with his joint overheating. So, what his mechanic did, well, he said he had a problem with the overheating because I guess when the, when the airflow come in, it would, get, it would get trapped right here. Now the line out, the air to go through it, whatever. But he said, basically, he said it was overheating. So, what I did, I went on here to drill me one, two, three, four. Let me see. Now, I, I actually did five of them jerk. I did me five holes at the bottom. And I did me three across the top. So, that'll actually help have a spot for the alcohol to escape it. But anyway, let me go ahead and pop this joint on. So, we got to go ahead and get this thing started, boy. We got to go ahead and get this thing started. And then, without talking about, as far as the radiator, the arm. Um, Pull the thing up close. Far the scry, I see it flushing up. See, that's flush right there at the, at the bottom. Now I gotta do the top. I mean, I did the top, now I gotta get the bottom to the hill. Okay. I'm just going through a pocket to make sure it's flush. Okay. Y'all tell me, y'all tell me what y'all think about that thing. You feel me? My whole life, I always had like a the stock radiator with the um, hey, the stock radiator with the um, with the the mechanical fan with the cuss fan, the stock stuff. So one day, I always told myself I want to step it up one day with the electric fan stuff and all that. And um, so here we go. Y'all tell me what y'all think about that joint. The three row, the three row. Performance aluminum radiator with the electric fan set up. You feel me? Y'all think that junk look good? I like this junk now. You feel me? But yeah, that's it. That's it right there. It look pretty good to me. That shit look good to me, dog. I fool with it. Y'all hold on for a minute. Let me get this stuff out of the way. Hold on for a minute. I'm about to get ready to go put this thing in the car, too. And I'm going to let y'all ride with me and do it. Hold on. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and drop that old one in here. So it's gonna be trash. Y'all hold on for a minute. It's gonna be trash. So I'm gonna get that out of the way. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, um. I'm going to holler back at y'all when I get to the spot. Get y'all positioned and everything. Come figure, go ahead and install that little joint. So the radiator thing is about my way. 
And the only thing I had left as far as the radiator is wiring it up. So y'all hold on for a minute. Yeah, I ain't in the spot. Y'all come ride with the boy though. I'm about to get ready to pull up in a little bit. But man, woo! These last three days out here, man, it been hot as hell, boy. It's 86 right now. You feel me? But that's why I was like, man, I'm gonna wait till the evening. But I was like, man, we still got a lot going on. We still got a lot to do. So we need to um we need to try to take a advantage of take advantage of the time that we got for knocking some stuff out. Forget that heat. I'm from Mississippi, I was born in the heat. <laughs> so I ain't gonna trip about that a little bit. We need to go get it right out of here, so. So yeah, so hold on for a minute. Well, yo, how y'all little day going today? What y'all got going on down there? There's a lot going on in the world today, man. I tell you that, my boy. A lot, a lot of my, my people out there, man, we angry right now, man. There's a lot of shit going on. A lot of shit going on. But yo, man, I'm trying to get the um, I really hit it car just like a lot of folks really hit it car. But man, one thing about it, when you doing stuff on your own, you ain't paying nobody. You gotta take your time with it, dog. And one thing about it, if somebody else do it, you paying somebody to do it. You can complain if something ain't right. Cause you paying them, and you don't make time. I hate being on another man time. But when you doing it yourself, you gotta do this shit right, man. You gotta make sure every boat is tight. Make sure you don't got no wires in the way. Make sure you don't got no wires in the way. Touch it where it can burn something, blow something up. You just got to make sure everything right. So that's what I'm doing. That's why it's taking me a minute, dog. I, I'm a neat freak. And when it comes to that car, I'm really a neat freak. Then wait on pods to come in. You got to um, put pods on, take them back off. The see you got no clearance. And you know what I'm saying? You got to try different stuff, man. But I love it, though. I love, I love everything about it. Y'all hold on for a minute. Alright. We in the spot. Let's stick in the jump too. We in the spot. Um, so we get ready to put the right aid in. So y'all tap in with that boy. Here go the two here go the two bolts I was talking about with my wrist and the holes right here with them. So hold on, y'all tap in with me. Make sure I got my thing down enough. I don't make sure I got them down enough for my right aid to sit on. So hold on. Getting exclusive, baby. Y'all were with me when I first took it out the box. Y'all gonna be with me when I sit this joint in here. Let me get right. Let me get in there first. I might have to make some adjustments. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You know what? I got to tilt y'all down a little bit too for y'all to actually see what's going on. Y'all might not see me that much, but I don't want to give y'all a good version of the radiator stuff. Hold on for a minute. Make sure everything is sitting here right. Like I'm on it. Got this. Hold on. 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 I had to actually make you some kind of support thing for the bottom. Hold on for a minute, y'all. I'm gonna have to take this joint out. Hold on. Get that joint right, right there. The bottom piece trying to pop up now. Hold on. Take time right here. Let me show you what's going on. Oh, um, see right here, this is the part I said sit flush, but it done popped up a little bit. It flush on this side, so basically you just gotta just seat it in there and make sure it's flush. So hold on for a minute. Let me post this thing up. Y'all get a good verse of everything. Y'all hold on for a minute. Don't do it with no helmet, do it with a rubber mallet.
gonna get that thing right now. That's what it cost stuff all about. That's why I say you gotta push stuff in and take stuff out. You gotta make changes to get everything right. Make sure everything is sitting right how you want it. No way, hold on for a minute, man. Thought I was doing something by keeping that joint closed, but I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna let some goddamn out here. Hey, man. Hey, Tap in with that boy. Like, comment, subscribe, tell somebody so they can tell somebody for real. We getting it in, baby. We getting it in. Alright. I'm on. Um, I'm running the first the first boat down now. It remind you. Oh dang, you know what? I'm tripping. I only got my own gloves on. You gotta have them gloves on you doing the car stuff, boy. For real. Hand won't get dirty. I'm tripping. We just trying to get this done put in though. Oh hey, this a nice snow. This a nice snow on um, junk too. Nice, nice snow little fit. I messed with it. Hold on a minute. We tighten it down now. Tighten it down now. Let's get my rack. A little closer too. I just had to sit y'all up here while I had it on. Damn! You seen that right though? That's the stuff I'm gonna go through. You gotta pay attention to now. Then I'm gonna broke my neck right though. I got down on hell. Hold on. Everything wanna get in the way now. That's how the devil work though. Everything wanna get away when you see the boy making progress. Get a position right for y'all folks. Alright. Alright, uh, y'all chill out with me real quick. I'm just tighten everything up now. Don't worry about seeing me. I just want y'all to get that breathing. Oh, what's going on? Hey, mind you. These are the little brackets I made. That's why I was talking about my mock-up. See, the last time, this is all I had to do. And I would have been done, Doc. I would have been done with everything. But, it worked out pretty good. See what I'm talking about? Now that thing in that real snow. That's what I'm talking about. In that real snow, Doc. God damn, man. Yup, in that real snow, she ain't going nowhere. We don't got no more kettle fan on this joint no more. Alright. Now. Now I can bring my arm. Now I can bring my arm. My hoses around. Ah, darn it. Y'all hold on. Let me put that thing on. Let me put y'all in poly rain real quick. Pick what we left off at. So now. I'll definitely pop the upper radiator hose on. Everything back to go. Y'all tap in with me. Best thing smoking on YouTube. Let me see what way I had this thing. Alright, that should be it right there. I'm not loosen that motherfucker. Got a little tight. Put the upper radiator hose on and I'm gonna tap back in with y'all 
on the next joint. Taking that little guard out, put that on. God damn, I'm still true. Gotta unloosen this one up now. I'll tap in with that boy. Got a lot going on. Got to take advantage of the little time I got before I go to work. Because remind you, I'm working. And I'm getting it in when I can. You feel me? Getting it in when I can, dog. I'm ready to go ahead and get this thing, get this thing right, though. So that's why today I was like, you know what? It's hot. Man, we got to do what we got to do. We got to do what we got to do, dog. So yeah, man. Y'all follow me in the comments. Let me know how y'all like that um, how y'all like that the uh, aluminum radiator. This aluminum radiator with the um, with the electric fan joint. I ordered the radiator off Amazon. I think OZ cooling parts make it. Then we're gonna see how good it is. All right. Let me show y'all something before I let y'all go. Yeah, I'm already swinging everything. That's the radiator. Then the brackets right there. Then the brackets. You feel me? That's what I was talking about as far as the original spot where my original squad went at. As you can see, that radiator ain't moving an inch. I got the upper radiator holes up there. Upper radiator hole, I'm figuring right through the bottom. I'm going to check this out though. I'm going to end this junk. A Mississippi TV. Tap in with the boy. Best thing is smoking on YouTube, shout out. They don't like they don't let the right boy get on YouTube. You feel me? I'm showing you the good, the bad, the ugly, uncut, raw. You know what I'm saying? All that though. You seen what was going on? I'm gonna trip broke my leg on camera on the goddamn header. But there will be going on behind the scene. Most people just see me when I come through. The bird, the dying she clean. But you know what I'm saying? Only y'all tap in behind closed doors, see the work I put in. Look at that sweat. Then when you doing it on your own though, you feel me? So just, just be patient with me. I'm coming on with it. But um it is taking a little time. Oh yeah. Let me show y'all the um the header joint too. You feel me? I got that driver side up there. I got that driver side up there. And when everything gets said and done, I'ma um I'm gonna let you know the name of the header, the people who are making they down in Arkansas. If you got a box Chevy and you want some bigger head headers to fit, cause like I said, I had one of five eight. I had one of five eights, and then nobody made hell for angle plug heads when them boy down in Arkansas did. So, man, I'ma holler at y'all. Y'all be easy out there, be safe, man. Mississippi, Mississippi TV, tap in with that boy. I'm out of here.